I love nature. Finding yourself in a quiet place where you just hear water or you see trees, where you're by yourself but you're, you're immersed in absolutely everything. And that's what I feel like every time I go out there. Going on a run, walking and exploring certain parts of the green belt. It takes me to a unique place where all my ideas come to light. I paint and draw whatever images come to mind, and the meanings seem to present themselves at a later time. Of course, I've planned out work such as portraits and landscapes, but the pieces that mean the most to me have that extra element of surprise. The pieces you see hanging up on the wall are perfect examples. My work has always consisted of me going out, experiencing life, and then going to that quiet place where images appear and need to be expressed. The medium changes to fit the scenario. This past year has been all about painting in oils and acrylics, whatever metaphors I think about the most. My name is Chelsea. I met Maria through NNU our freshman year. She was a peer of mine, and I've always just really enjoyed her artwork. In general, Maria's art is beautiful. She is able to analyze and approach her artwork from unique and really thought-provoking angles. The effort and dedication of this piece is phenomenal. I absolutely love it. I couldn't be happier. She managed to capture my personality and the expression. And the colors are just beautiful as well. When I was eight years old, I had to have three major kidney surgeries. While recovering in the hospital, my free time was spent with other children and the art therapist. Drawing and painting was a welcome distraction that for me turned into a lifestyle. At 13, my family moved to a new house in Boise, where our next door neighbor introduced herself as a retired teacher and artist from Hawaii. Elaine Blitman has been my mentor and dearest friend for the past 10 years. Maria and I met more than 10 years ago when I began inviting neighborhood kids to come and do art things with me. And she was the only one who lasted the whole time. <laughs> and so we've, we've grown up together by a lot. And we've experimented with different kinds of painting and drawing and new media. Remember this one? Yes. <laughs> the one that I will start and then put off for a while and start again. But I think we need it finished. I think so too. What color is this going to be? Can get I still haven't decided. I'm thinking probably more of a blue. Mm -hmm. More of a blue color to offset because there's so many red and flesh tones in it. So much warm. It needs, mm -hmm. it needs a cooler blue color. I think so too. The idea was to do what you like the most and what you feel most interested in. Art is something I will always do. Because in my journey, I've come to realize how much I want to pursue art as a career. I believe art is a reaction. The process and time put in to make a visual representation or thought of this reaction truly matters. Woo!